no uh, medicine is free of uh, uh, adverse events or uh, dangerous interactions. And uh, ayahuasca contains monoamine oxidase inhibitors. Monoamine oxidase inhibitors can interact with other, uh, other medicines, so people should be careful. People who have uh, heart conditions, who have uh, high blood pressure, they should be cautious. Uh, people uh, who may have some uh, certain psychiatric disturbances, if you suffer from schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, alterations in perception or uh, delirious thoughts at some point in your life, maybe the ayahuasca is not for you. And uh, I get from time to time emails of people who have relatives who have traveled to the Amazon and uh, have experienced uh, psychological uh, problems afterwards. So it's not, uh, it's not risk free. I want to, I would like to stress this, that people should be careful and not just uh, think uh, that, the, that the best uh, thing they can do to solve their problems is get their backpack and go to the uh, Peruvian Amazon and uh, find the first person who claims to be a shaman and then and take whatever they, they give them. Ayahuasca is also becoming a, a big business in South America. So maybe the person uh, you are that's uh, offering you ayahuasca is it's not really interested in your welfare, just interested in, in getting your money. So that's also part of uh, human nature. It's called greed. So uh, not because uh, they live in Latin America, they are less greedy than people in the US or in Europe. So there are honest uh, shamans or facilitators, and there are dishonest shamans and facilitators. So sh people should be careful who they approach.